Good morning, everyone. We are tracking some changes for the upcoming holiday weekend. Scattered storms on Friday will line up along a cold front that cuts the humidity for the weekend, so it will be noticeably cooler. But the waves will be building for Sunday and into Labor Day, making for a high swim risk. So any cloud cover that we have out there this morning, that's going to be lifting as we go through the afternoon. We become mostly sunny. High temperatures pushing into the 80s. Still a little steamy outside, though. So your forecast high, you will notice a little bit of cooling lakeside, probably 79 for our friends there in Zion and Waukegan, Winthrop Harbor, 81 in the city, but go to 89 degrees in Joliet. So head away from the water and that's where you find the heat. So we're tracking this front for Friday and in the morning we could have a few showers. Then as we work our way through the day, the change today in the model runs is showing a slower forward speed of this front. So later in the evening, we still could have some scattered showers or rumbles of thunder around before the front finally drops south of us. And that cools things down as we step through your weekend. So 84 degrees on Saturday, less humid air. Sunday, another cold front comes in. So it's actually a pair of cold fronts that's going to make conditions rough at the beaches. So for our uh, Labor Day boating conditions, they could be dangerous with high waves and also dangerous rip currents as well. This is Sunday. Sunday and into Monday. So let's enjoy this dry day. A little steamy, 85, cooler by the lake. Tonight, skies will be partly cloudy, still muggy and mild, 72 for our overnight low. Then we bring in that scattered shower and storm chance tomorrow. Call in 50 50, but warmer, 88 degrees. So that's our steamy, stormy day. And then the front comes through. We go to 84 on Saturday. Then that second front comes through. And Jackie, our Labor Day high, only 73 degrees. So that's a big change, especially when you pull away the humidity.